This may surprise a few people, however sleeping has a huge impact when it comes to learning new information. In this video I'm going to show you how to make sleeping work for you, when it is really important, and how to use downtime to ensure that you remember the facts and figures that you need to. I'm Dean Roller and this is Study Summit. Do you worry and stress about an exam coming up? and perhaps negate the fact that you have to sleep and spend all your time trying to cram in as much as possible the night before? I mean, if we only have 12 hours before an exam, it might seem like the best thing to do. Maybe not, and I'm going to show you why. A recent study headed by Jessica Payne, a University of Notre Dame psychologist, found that sleeping just after having learned new information showed significant improvement in test results 12 hours later. A group of 200 students were assigned to learn certain word pairs in the morning and then again at night. Half of the subjects were tested right after a night's sleep. The other half were tested without any sleep at all. Memory overall was far superior in the group that slept. Even more surprisingly, the students who slept right after having learned something new were able to retain even more of the information. This got me thinking. If students in this study were able to retain even more of the information when they went to sleep right after having learned something new, would a nap after a study session help? Researchers Tucker and Fishbane conducted an experiment that gave me an answer. They took a group of 31 people and asked them to remember certain pairs of images as they were going to be tested on this later on. Participants were either given 90 minutes to have a nap or do whatever they wanted with their wake time. Participants who napped demonstrated superior retention for all the things that they were asked to remember. And this study not only helped them just to recall things, the participants who had a nap were also given a surprise test based on some things they weren't asked to remember, and they did far better in that test as well. These experiments highlight that sleep really is just as important as studying and preparing for an exam. So to sum up, when preparing for an exam be sure to get a good night's sleep. A good night's sleep will not only help you to remember what you need to, it will also allow your brain to think outside the box and answer any unexpected questions that pop up in the exam. Ideally, you also want to go over important points just before going to sleep, or having a nap. They're not just for old people, and you can have a nap just about anywhere. When you do this, in some sense it's like you're telling your sleeping brain what to work on while you check out for a few hours. I hope you got something out of this video on sleep, and realised the importance of it, especially before an upcoming exam. If you did, then subscribe to this channel. I look forward to sharing the practical tips that make the most of your time.